Hello everyone, welcome to Spiritual Butterfly. Today I will be doing a love reading for the sign of Leo. So Leo, we're going to be looking at what is going out and what is coming in in your love life. Remember that this is a general reading, so not everything is going to resonate. Take what does, apply it, leave the rest. Also Leo, like this video, subscribe to the channel and click that notification bell in order to receive notifications when I post. So Leo, I'm going to go right ahead and we're going to jump into your love messages. So Spirit, what is going out of Rio's love life? Okay. Oh, I have the three of pentacles in the reverse. Let's get another message. And I have worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. Okay, Leo. So you are no longer waiting for someone to get on the same page as you. It's like you're not begging anyone to be in your life. You're not begging this person um, to do right by you. It's like you're no longer doing that. I feel like with this worth waiting for, you've been waiting for a long time for this person to get on the same page. And it's like you're just no longer doing it. Um, this is just you saying, you know what? Forget about it. Let's click see what is coming in spirit what is coming in to leo's love life all right leo oh i have the will of fortune and i have temperance and i heard like changing up how you do things because you're no longer waiting for this person to do right by you to put in that effort it's like you are recognizing your value your worth in that if anything, you're worth waiting for. So with this will of fortune and this temperance, it's like finally there's going to be a relationship, a partnership, a union coming into your life that is very balanced. Because you're able to walk away from this situation and shut out that person close this chapter in your life recognize that this person was not going to change it didn't matter how long you waited leo it's like now i heard let me bless you now spirit can bless you with someone who's on the same page with someone who is equally yoked spirit can finally give you that balanced relationship so let's clarify to go a little bit deeper spirit tell me more about this three of pentacles Yep. Strife. Five of Wands. <laughs> this was a battle. <laughs> this was a battle for you. A lot of back and forth, push and pull type of energy when it came to this relationship. I heard like do right. It's just like this person would not do right by you, Leo. Let's get a message for this Five of Wands. Look at what I have. Death in the reverse. Yeah. This was just a never ending cycle. This relationship. A never ending cycle. I heard like pain. It caused you a lot of um, emotional distress. It was just. I heard like hardship. This was just a very hard and challenging relationship to deal with. Um, I heard like pull their weight. This person would never pull their weight. Leo. Let's get a message for the will of fortune. Look at what I have. Peace. You're finally going to have peace. You're finally going to have, I keep getting equally yoked. You're finally going to be in a relationship that is very balanced. Let's get a message for temperance. And I heard like waited for a long time. For some of you, you waited for this person for a long time. You waited for this turnaround in your love life for a very long time. And look at what I have. The five of pentacles worry. Exactly. You're no longer going to have to worry. For some of you, 
by you walking away from this relationship, I heard like stress, like you are releasing the stress. Yes, yeah, like you're no longer allowing this person to stress you, to worry you. It's like your peace is you leaving this relationship. That's what's going to give you peace, Leo. I also heard coming in, yeah, for some of you with this five of pentacles in reverse, like I heard single, you may have been single. I heard for a long time for someone. And it's like you finally, you waited and like finally you're getting that love offer that you desire. Let's clarify. Spirit, tell me more about this two of swords. Tell me more about peace. Come on, the world. This is going to be a new beginning. This is going to be a new cycle for you. And for some of you, it's like with this world in her hand, it's like, I'll take my peace. So it's like by you walking away from this relationship, it's like you took back, you took back your peace. You took back your life. And it's like now you have this amazing new beginning taking place for you. Now everything is finally starting to come into balance. Now you're getting everything that you desire when it comes to a relationship. Let's get a message for the five of pentacles in the reverse. Look at what I have. Strength. I heard you don't have to do this anymore. Yes. Leo. This is your card and yes, it's in the reverse, but spirit says like you recognize you no longer have to do this anymore. Like you recognize that you don't have to be in a relationship that is very difficult, that is very challenging. It's like you are learning that you don't have to give to someone who doesn't deserve it. It's like you're learning your worth, you're learning your value. And it's like you know when to walk away, you know when to leave it behind. You recognize when it's just over, when it's done, when there's nothing else that could be salvaged. So let's get some overall advice for you. Spirit, what overall advice do you have for Leo? I have the six of wands in the reverse. I have the king of cups. And I have the seven of wands. I heard like worth fighting for. With this King of Cups, it's like Spirit is saying that Leo, you, it's necessary. Spirit says like it's necessary. Like you had to learn this lesson. It was necessary for you to learn what is worth fighting for and what isn't. It's like what's going to give you your fulfillment. What's going to give you what you want and what is not going to give you what you want. So it's like with this King of Cups, it's like you learning how to make a very important choice when it comes to your relationships. A very significant choice for yourself when it comes to your love life. On what to fight for and what not to fight for. I heard like leave it alone. On when to leave it alone. When to let go. And when to continue to put in the effort. Like you had to go through this with this person. So that you can learn like you know what. Some things just aren't worth it. Some people just are not worth it. You needed to learn that. And then some people are. It's all about the person. And their intentions and their actions. So it's like with this King of Cups, you learning when to give, what to give your time, your emotions to, and what not to pour into. So it's like I heard worth fighting for. Yes, yeah, Spirit says that this is you learning what is worth fighting for and who is worth fighting for when it comes to your love life. So Leo, 
These are your messages. I hope they resonate. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Everyone, stay blessed.